Yo, what is up YouTube, it's here and today I have a Final Fantasy XIV Heaven's World video for you and this video is just to show you how to get the other mounts to fly in the um, other zones when you unlock the air currents and what you do is just go talk to this guy here uh, the coordinates are 7x and Y11 in I'm in Ishgard and he should give you the quest uh, before you can get the quest though you have to progress the story um, so just keep checking back every now and then and so uh, yeah you talk to this guy and he talks about your chocobo and how you smell of a chocobo scent and then you'll it's a lot of running around but it's it's worth it in the end and you'll see at the end of this video um, that I actually get my other mounts to fly my fat chocobo my normal chocobo and but the the eyeball uh, the airman I think it is and the, uh, the it doesn't fly I don't think the bomb chair from the uh, cobalt beast tribe flies either so uh, it's, right now it's just the fat chocobo and the uh, and the normal your normal chocobo which is handy um, yeah when you get him when you uh, you can have him out to fight with you as well to level him up and then just fly off when you need to so uh, after you talk to this dude, you'll go to the the Dravanian uh, forelands, and you'll talk to another guy. He's just at the stables in the um, in uh, in the town here. And you'll see it coming up in a second. So you just talk to this guy, and then he'll talk to you about your chocobo, and and then he'll send you off to do uh, some other shit as well. Um, it's a pretty easy quest. So nothing too difficult. But um, I'm loving Heaven towards so far, it's pretty good. Um, just leveling up mostly. Uh, I've done one of the primals, you've probably seen that video on my channel if you subscribe to me, and that was pretty good. Uh, but yeah, still leveling up and gearing up, that's pretty good. So uh, here's this guy here, Prior Fox, I think his name is or whatever, I don't know how you say that. But he just talks to you about the process of teaching your chocobo. And then he'll make you go fetch a few things. Um, I can't remember what exactly. Uh, oh yeah, bees. You have to go kill some some mobs. And I'm about to go do that now. I think. Yep. Trying to work out where the hell it is on the map. So yeah, this is um this is how you do it. The quest is called I believe I can fly. I think. That's the start quest, yeah. So um, yeah, just look for it in the in the stables. You should be able to you should be able to find it pretty easily. If you haven't, just progress the story along and the main quest, and uh, yeah, you should be able to get it. Later on, you actually get a single seater uh, airship mount. This is pretty cool. So I'm um, looking out for that too. If you uh, um, if you have early access and you're leveling up right now. I think the um, expansion's actually out today, if I remember correctly. So yeah, I'm just killing these bee clouds. As you see here, I absolutely hit like a truck now with it. I've upgraded all my 130 gear. It's nothing too difficult. You should be able to get it done pretty easily. I think I'll flare up here, yeah. And that'd be that. extra flare for good measure now you have to go back to the dude and give him the the stuff I think if I remember correctly and there goes my phone sorry about that I'm not sure if you heard that oh no I have to kill some more do I? oh no it's someone else's so yeah back to this dude in tail feather He's just over the bridge here. If you come come into Tail Feather, you just walk across the bridge, take a left, and he's straight down, and you'll see him. You run straight into him. He's just at the Chocobo stables. Yeah, so just follow this video, and um, you should get your Chocobo to fly. Blah blah blah. <laughs> 
it's a lot of reading and a lot of fetching, but it's well worth it in the end. And flying is so good. I really, really love the flying in this. And I hope they actually bring it to the other, the older zones eventually. But we'll just have to wait and see. Alright. Well, that's that done. Now, I need to take my chocobo. This next part of the quest, you need to take your chocobo to uh, the two spots here. And you just like, um, like attune to it, I guess. Like you do with the ethers. And you just go up to it and press it. And you'll see in a minute what happens. You have to get the breeze in your chocobo or something. It's pretty easy. Probably finding it's the hardest part. You have to keep checking your map here. It's just up here to the right. If you pause the video, you can probably just get the coordinates. Almost there. Ooh. It's taking its time. I think this one's actually up on top of that tower there, if I remember correctly. Yep, it is. I see it. The, the entrance to the tower should be just around the back here, I think. You just climb up the stairs, it's like on that little ledge. Pretty easy to find. Yep. On uh, on uh, PlayStation, you just hit X. I'm not sure what it is on uh, on um, PC. I think that's 1414. The coordinates for that. I could be wrong though. Just pause the video if you want to the actual coordinates and the next area is in the western highlands you just do the same it's the same thing and you actually get to see my um you actually get a flying chocobo a black chocobo um if you progress the story along it's uh you get a chocobo whistle and you'll see it in action here actually um i unlock um I've unlocked the flight in this zone, so you'll see the black chocobo, see how flying looks. Um, I actually put my chocobo away and get out the black one, which is uh, ready to fly. As soon as you get the whistle, you just use it, and it, if you have uh, a tune to all the ethers, then um, yeah, you'll be able to fly straight away with this chocobo. This is just to unlock the, the others. you see flying here, it's pretty quick. It's I think it's a hundred times faster than uh, ground mounts. And, um, yeah, it's amazing. I love flying. It's so good. It's so much easier. You don't have to worry about uh, aggro and all the mobs because as soon as you run through, everything aggroes you here. It's kind of a, a challenge again, which is good. I don't mind it. It adds a bit of a challenge back to the game that was kind of missing. Once you hit 50, nothing really bothered you except for the silk land, so it was annoying. But um, it's got that element of danger to it, which is good. You got to be careful too, not to uh, pull too many mobs, otherwise you'll die. Here's the uh, destination here. It's just the same thing. Press the uh, thing. Yeah, make sure you get your chocobo out too. You have to have your chocobo out to uh, for this part of the quest too. So uh, make sure you go for Nessie Greens. And that's pretty much it. Now you have to go back to uh, back to the town where the um, other guy is. Tail feather, I think it is. Yes. And you just go talk to the guy, and he'll give you a uh, a hat. It's like a hat. You don't even have to wear it. Your chocobo flies. You don't need to to have it on. But um, when you use it up, it'll be under your barding under head if you want to wear it. It's not. Not, nothing special. Doesn't look that great, really. Um, yeah, it's not really that good. And you don't 
you don't need it to fly, so I just leave it in there. I don't really even use it. So yeah, just about to go talk to this guy, and then um, I will show you a few of the mounts flying the uh, my normal tracker bow and my fat tracker bow. So you'll be able to see how the fat tracker bow looks. So I'll just talk to this guy again. Blah blah blah. Come on. <laughs> Too much reading. And there you go. Done. So now my chocobo can fly. So yeah, this is just a tutorial, um, just to show you, because I've seen a lot of questions in the shouts, asking how how do you get your other mounts to fly, and um, this is how you do it. So uh, yeah, I just thought I'd quickly make this video to uh, to show you guys, and um, yeah, just follow this, and you should be set, and enjoy flying your with your normal chocobo. So this is, yeah, this is just me with my, my chocobo. You just double tap Y on the um, double jump. I've got it set so you double jump and there you go. My chocobo is flying. So awesome. It's really good when you're leveling your chocobo too. You can just double tap Y and fly off. So good. And this is the, I have to put my chocobo away here. And this is my fat choker bow flying. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all I have for this video. If you like the video, uh, please do so by hitting that thumbs up. Um, I really appreciate the support. Uh, leave a comment in the comments. And let me know if you guys have done this already or um, what you think of flying. Uh, yeah, uh, subscribe too also. And that's pretty much going to wrap it up here. And... Uh, I oh, will see you in the next video. Bye.